What? What are you doing? I'm playing Pokemon Smile. It's an app that helps you remember to brush your teeth. My dad gets mad at me if I don't brush them regularly. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> Wait, why do you have Adrian's phone? What? That's not Adrian's phone. Of course it is. Look, his father just sent him a message. Adrian, did you brush your teeth? Also, where are you? Let's call him and inform him that you find his son's phone. Maybe it's even better to video call him so he can be sure it's really us. Wait! Cat Noir? Yes, my lady. Is this really you? Huh? Of course it's me. And now, would you please tell me who did this to you? So I can beat the bed out of him. It's really you. So, do you want to tell me what's going to happen in the future? Oh, cat. I'm so sorry. <laughs> so sorry. After the final battle, Adrian? My lady, are you okay? You're just standing in the rain. Yeah, just thinking, I guess. So much has changed with my life with father. I can imagine. But at least one thing hasn't changed. We're still a team. Even if Paris doesn't need saving, I will always be here when you need me. And if you don't, I'll still be right by your side. You know, nothing has changed between us, right? Well, it's changed a little, at least for me. Ahem. <clears throat> Marnette, you shouldn't have to stay out here just because I'm moping. Pierce is saved, you should enjoy it. Spend time with your friends, with your family. Go find that boy you love and wrap your arms around him. But... Don't worry about me, I'll be fine. That's what I came out here to do. Adrian, I love you. I'm sorry, Adrian. But this is hopeless. Hawkmoth, Gabriel, whatever, must have destroyed Pierce by now. Marinette, don't give up. We can think of something. Think? What do I know? I've been absolutely clueless about you. Your father, even with being the guardian. And now Pierce is going to suffer because of me. Marnette, no! Please don't say that! I've been clueless too! Adrian? Do you ever think what it would have been like if Master Fu never gave us the miraculous? What? I mean, I would hate to think of never meeting Tiki. But what if you and I just met in the school and lived normal lives? Maybe I would have gotten the courage to talk to you eventually. We could have been best friends and let some other people save Pierce. If it had, this would have never happened. I mean, your dad would still be, you know. But I've messed up so much. And it all led to this. Maybe Pierce would have been better off without me. Marnette, no, don't say that. We were meant to be a team and to meet like we did. If I hadn't gotten to know you as Ladybug, I would have had no idea how fearless you are. Or how sarcastic you can be when I get on your nerves. Or even how you can think of a way out of any problem. And if you didn't know me as Adrian, you'd probably think I'm just shameless flirt, who's nothing but trouble. Well, you are though. But you're more than that too. Exactly, that's what I mean. As bad as the things are right now, it wouldn't change a single moment we've shared. Us against the world, right? Always, my lady, always. So, Ladybug, any new life updates? Well, it isn't really revealing, so I guess I could tell you. I have a boyfriend now. <laughs> oh, what's he like? Oh, he's wonderful. He always sees the best in others. And he's so sweet. He's also apparently a giant dork. And I love him all the... Cat Noir, I... Well, don't let me stop you from talking about how amazing he is. You think he's stunning, right? Oof! 
He must be. I want to meet him. Could you please introduce me to him, Ladybug? In an odd twist of fate, I feel strangely threatened by you right now. Of course you're threatened. I mean, look at me. He is my boyfriend, Cat Noir. Mine. <laughs> hey, my lady, how old are you? My age? Okay, Ladybug, this is your chance. You can get revenge for all his pranks on you. <laughs> I'm nine. <laughs> What? Yesterday, I read this joke. Why should you always knock on a refrigerator door before opening it? Why? In case there's a salad dressing. <laughs> this is really funny, Elia. <laughs> Meanwhile, in quarantine... Make sure you don't mess up this next step. Got it! Now, add about third of the sifted almond flour mixture at a time to the beaten egg whites and use a spatula to gently fold until combined. After the last addition of almond flour, continue to fold slowly until the batter folds into ribbons and... Wow! Are you even listening to me? Sorry, milady, you may have to repeat that last part. Oh! What will I do with you? I'll work hard. And how they are. <laughs> They're delicious, Adrian. Good job. Hello, everyone. For our science project, we searched the human anatomy. I'll be using this laser pointer to identify the bones. Be sure to follow along. Oh. Da -da 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 -da. Well, to start, the forearm has two main bones. Oh my god, the red lights look really cool. Did it just move? I really want to. And the other? No, 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 no. I can't chase it. Oh my god. But, but, no, I'm a human, not a cat. They're connected to a joint. In the leg bone? Yeah. Huh? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Adrian Agrest is pointing to our project. I don't know what is happening, but he's really cute. Alia, could he like me? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. I want his babies. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Are you, uh, having fun there? No abort mission. Where's the Nakuma when you need one? Oh my god, why? Please, no, 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 no. Plague, kill me. Ladybug, take the wheel. Why? At least Ladybug will never see me. Why? <laughs> Nino, stop laughing. I have brought dishonor to my family. My sons. No, 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 no. Do you want to taste? Hmm, more like the taste of your lips. Ah, uh, Alia, I think I like a bad boy. Hey! Hey, Marnette, I'm a bad boy. Tell her, Nino. Adrian once ate my lost cookies. He's a super bad guy. So bad. Thanks, Nino. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Marnette, guess who? Cat? Ah, oh my god! Ah, oh my god, I'm sorry, I didn't know. It was just a joke, I swear, I don't know why even... It's okay, Marnette. Hey, there are cheerleader tryouts tomorrow. You should try out, you'd be really good. I don't know, cheerleading is not really my thing. I think you can do it. I see you in gym class, pulling off all the splits and stretches. You're really flexible. Hmm, maybe I'll think about it. This is gonna sound crazy, but what if Marnette is Ladybug? But how can Marnette be Ladybug? If she's just a friend? Well, princess, I would be honored if you let me sign your cast. Sure, if you stop with the bravado. Voila! Think of what all your classmates will think. Well, you certainly made your mark. Now, you'll be more careful, princess. I wish I could be there to protect you and Ladybug all the time. 
I know you would, cat. Hold on a second. Hmm. What can this mean? Do you know what a cat's way of keeping law and order is? Claw enforcement! <laughs> that's really funny! <laughs> well, that's not a fair test. That joke is hilarious. Cat Noir will show up soon. Yeah, or Ladybug. Or Cat Noir. Or Ladybug. Or Cat Noir. Why does she keep seeing Cat Noir? Ladybug's plans are way better and useful. I know she liked Cat Noir the best. Ah, uh, stop mentioning Ladybug. She's totally useless right now. Why does Adrian prefer Ladybug anyway? Or, or maybe, maybe he likes. She still likes. Do you have a thing for Cat Noir? Do you like Ladybug? Y yes maybe What? He likes me! Ah! Okay, cat. Battle is over. Are you gonna tell me why I caught you crying earlier? Because you were uncharacteristically on time for petrol? Cat! Okay, okay. I guess it's just a lot of pressure, you know? Being the prettiest boy in Paris. Cat! Right, a prince like you. It's Aladdin. That's pretty obvious. And every other stuffed shirt, swaggering peacock I've met. It's him with other clothes. Just go, jump off the balcony. No, look at him. That's weird. Like Clark Kent who deceive everybody just with glasses. Or Hannah Montana with a wig. So true. You have to be an idiot to not recognize your loved one. I can't believe it. Mm. Maybe. No, there are no excuses for that. It's just insane. Adrian, how do I look? With your eyes, Marnette. Marnette, seems your parents invited someone to help and celebrate our engagement. Really? Who? Beardus! Hey. Hey? I can't sleep. I can. Good night. Thanks for helping me pack up my room, Adrian. Of course, I'm the perfect boyfriend, aren't I? Mm, of course. I'm gonna go grab us some stuff from the bakery. I'll be right back. Thanks, Marnette. I don't remember helping with that box. A cat? I don't remember Marnette ever having a cat. What on earth is in here? I brought up cookies. I know you love them. Aren't I the perfect care friend? Of course, my lady. Ah. Plug? Cat Noir? What the hell? In the flesh, bugaboo. Well... I guess curiosity killed the cat. I honestly can't believe you kept these. Of course I kept them. They were gifts from my best friend after all. <laughs> I'm glad it's you, Marnette. Me too, Adrian. Hey, Alia. Do you still happen to have those edits of a ladybug where she's wearing a swimsuit? Uh, what do you want those for? Well, I'm looking for a new phone wallpaper, so I thought maybe... Oh, I see. Yeah, sorry, I don't have them anymore. But I know that Marinette still has them on her phone. You should ask her. I'm sure she'll be delighted to send them to you. Okay. Later that day... He wants what from me? Hi, Marinette. I wanted to ask you something. So I'm looking for a new phone wallpaper and Ella told me that... Wow, you really have a talent for editing, Alia. It looks so real. This is the best phone wallpaper ever. Maybe that's because it is real. <laughs> uh, what? A few hours earlier? Hurry up, Tiki. Marnette, is this really necessary? Adrian only asks for an edit. Of course it is. Adrian deserves the real thing and not just cheap edit. I still can't believe you've never seen Naruto before. 
Oh, shut up. You haven't even seen Sherlock. Oh, where are you? You're not side here, dude. Did you break the glass with your face? I seriously just replaced the window. I heard the song of my people. 